Okay, so now that we got all the sound files downloaded, they're on our desktop in our own little folder called Pirate Radio 1 Files. Let's go ahead and get GarageBand going. So let me just go ahead and launch GarageBand. Now, some of this is going to be tricky because I'm obviously being recorded into this microphone there, uh, which is a Yeti microphone. And I can't record the microphone and my system sounds at the same time or the sounds coming out of my computer purely. So I have to have them come out of the speakers and then back into the microphone. So it's not going to sound as clean as when you're doing it with headphones on. So just bear in mind, okay, your production is going to sound really, really good where mine is going to has to come out into the room and then back into the microphone and it just gets messed up. Okay, so uh, now we've got all this ready to go. So let me go ahead and start a new file here. Empty project. Okay, and we want to do a new recording with a microphone. Okay, and let's just do a couple little uh, checks here in preferences and audio. And um, you can see now it's trying to record just with my microphone that's built into my computer. So make sure that it's using a quality microphone, whatever you might be using, uh, your headphones or something like that. So I'm going to change this to the Yeti. Uh, sorry, I'm going to do output is system. So it goes um, out my headphone jack and into my speakers and then input is going to be Yeti. Okay, so that's that's set for me. Always double check this every time you start up GarageBand and you're going to record with the microphone. Double check the preferences to make sure it's actually recording with your microphone. That one right there and not uh, just the pinhole microphones that are on the side of the MacBook because those kind of stink. All right, so we've got that checked. Everything is good. And now um, next step we need to do is just get one of these files in here. So if we go back to um, the website, uh, you can see I'm starting to put these in. Now when you see it, all of these are gonna be filled out. But for me, I'm just building this lesson. So I just have this first one here and the second one. So hello, this is, and then you're gonna put your first name. So hello, this is Brad, and you're listening to Viper Radio. And I'm gonna use uh, file 44, logo Pulsar Sweep. So let me go ahead and go back to uh, my GarageBand and put that in the second track here. Okay, there it is, 44, Pulsar Sweep. I'm gonna drag that over, put that right at the beginning. Okay, and let me just zoom in a little bit here so we can really see what we got here. And... <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to record um, just probably a little bit after this and during the beep, beep, beep. No, maybe I'm going to record right after the beep, beep, beep. So that's where I'm going to start to record here. Let's listen to that again. Yeah, definitely I want to say, uh, what's the line? Okay, what is it again? Hello, my name is Brad and you're listening to Viper Radio. Okay, so let's go back and just go ahead and record that. Make sure that this track is not active, that the audio track, the one that you're recording into is active. And I'm gonna turn the metronome off so we don't hear that tick, tick, ticking away. And a countdown I like, so here we go. Hello, my name is Brad and you're listening to Viper Radio. Okay, so I can already tell that's not going to work out because I have uh, the sound. I'm, you've gotta record this with headphones so that you don't get the recording of the recording. So let me go ahead and delete that. I got to turn off my speakers and uh, do that again since I'm doing it a little bit different situation. You have headphones on, so it's going to work out a lot better for you. But here we go. I'm going to record right after the beep, beep, beep. My name is Brad and you're listening to... Oh, let me try that one again. That was a mess up. Hello, my name is Brad and you're listening to Viper FM. And it's not called Viper FM, it's called Viper Radio. Let me do that one more time. Hello, my name is Brad and you're listening to Viper Radio. Okay, finally we got a good recording of it here. So I'm gonna go ahead and trim that. Um, let me go ahead and put the scissors on here so we can really trim up close here. Down here, trim that. Oh, okay, so there's my file. Move that to wherever we want. I can turn my speakers back up so now we can hear that. Hello, my name is Okay, well, you absolutely cannot hear me. So uh, let's go ahead and turn that volume up. Turn this guy down. Hello, my name is Brad. And you're listening to Viper Radio. All right, so that's a little bit better there. I'm going to turn them up just a little bit more. And now let's go ahead and add a, an effect to my voice. 
I'm going to put him in a telephone vocal. Let me just isolate that so you can really just hear what that sounds like. Hello, my name is Brad, and you're listening to Viper Radio. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay, let me turn off isolation there. And... Hello, my name is Brad, and you're listening to Viper Radio. Okay, so that's that works out perfect. That one is actually ready to go. So let me just go ahead and trim this up so we don't have all that extra time on there. Uh, rewind the beginning. Okay, we should have done this at the beginning, but let's go ahead and save this. So file save. And make sure to save it in our desktop, Pirate Radio 1 files. And this is called, uh, let's call this station ID Brad 1. Just so, uh, you know, I'm going to get a lot of students turning this in. So make sure to put your first name on there and uh, which take it is. Maybe there's gonna be, maybe you're going to do five station IDs. But anyhow, this is number one for us. And I'm going to save that in there. So now it is actually saved inside our folder. If we go back to here, you can see it there. My GarageBand file is there because we're keeping everything all nice and organized. And since it is actually ready to go, everything is nice. Let me just maybe turn down that just a hair. Hello, my name is Brad, and you're listening to Viper Radio. Ooh, that sounds so good. Okay, so um, now I just need to uh, share that as an MP3. Export song to disk. Okay, MP3 is selected. We are in the right file. It inherits that from wherever we save it. It likes to save the MP3s in the same location as where the file exists. And um, everything looks good right there. Export. And that's done, I believe. Yeah, that's a, that's really quick because it's only just a three second song. And there's our MP3 of it. So if we double click on that. Hello, my name is Brad and you're listening to Viper Radio. Isn't that nice? Yeah, look at that. Brought it right into iTunes to play it there. That was really cool. So, um, and that's, you know, we can just continue this again and again. So let me let me do another one here. Let's go to File, New, save that. Empty project and microphone. Check the preferences to make sure that our microphone's really good. Yeti is on, speakers are on, everything's good there. Okay, so our next project here, according to this, is deep from the basement of ACS. This is Viper Radio, and we're going to use Voice Accent uh, 2. Number 2, Voice Accent More Music. So let's go ahead back to GarageBand and load that in to More Music. Here we go. Oops. All right, so we've got that in there. Okay, during the eh, 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 we're gonna that's when we're gonna do our little part there. Okay, so same thing with me, but you've got headphones. You don't need to do this, but I need to turn down my speakers so we don't hear the music. I'm just gonna record it right here at the beginning, and then I can move it anywhere I want. Deep from in the basement. How does it go? Deep from in the basement of ACS. This is Viper Radio. All right, piece of cake. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let me just see here. I'm going to get a little closer to my microphone here. Deep from in the basement, you're listening to Viper Radio. Should we turn that off? All right. Uh, isolation. Just turn my speakers back up. Let's listen to that. Deep from in the basement, you're listening to Viper Radio. Okay, much better. Now, I'm getting good waveforms here, okay? Now, remember, you've got to always make sure you're having good waveforms. The last one was a little quiet, so we had to really boost it up. But now I've got some good waveforms. I'm going to turn on the scissors here for editing. Let's just go and just really tighten this up a bit here. There we go. And um, I think I want about right there, but let's just uh, rewind. Oh, turn off isolation here. <laughs> Okay, same thing. Let's go in here and experimental um, megaphone, megaphone. And make sure always that you have this track highlighted, otherwise you're going to put megaphone on the on the music here. All right, let's isolate that and hear what that sounds like. Okay. Now. No. Deep from the basement, you're listening to Viper Radio. 
boy, I don't, I don't like that. I'm going to go back to um, voice down here and maybe just add a narration vocal, just something to clean it up here. Deep from in the basement, you're listening to Viper Radio. There we go. Narration vocal is sounding good on that one. Okay. Um, yeah, I think everything, th these are our actual controls for it that we could change things, but I think that's sounding pretty good. So uh, now let's just not take off the isolation. How does that sound? Deep from in the basement, you're listening to Viper Radio. You know, actually, I'm supposed to say deep from in the basement at ACS. So that's actually delete. Okay. And um, turn off my speakers. Let's get this re-recorded here. Deep from, in the the, deep from in the basement of ACS, you're listening to Viper Radio. Deep from in the basement of ACS, you're listening to Viper Radio. Okay, so it's obviously this take here is what I want. So let me just go ahead and turn on the scissors again. Let's just really tighten that up. Go to the end here. All right, uh, isolate that. Speakers back up here. Deep from in the basement of ACS, you're listening to Viper Radio. Okay, it's still inherited the narration vocals. That's still on, so that's still there. I'm just going to put that kind of, I'm just going to center it in all this music down here and just center it right there. All right, let's listen to how we got. Deep from in the basement of ACS, you're listening to Viper Radio. Very, very good. Okay, so I like that. That's sounding good. Oh, we forgot to save it again, so let's go ahead and save that. Uh, make sure it's in our Pirate Radio 1's file, and this is, uh, that's actually a sweeper, sweeper 1, uh, sweeper Brad 1. Okay, just so we got that, and then share, export song to disk. It is an MP3, and it's going to the right location. Export it. Those are what you turn into me, are the, uh, the MP3's, of course. Back this one up here there we go so we've got mp3 of the station id mp3 of the first sweeper and then we can just continue to go down the line and make these files that we can then use in the daily radio show you'll hear your voice up there doing one of the station ids or sweepers or something like that but that's essentially how it's done easy peasy right right okay <laughs>